Hi, in this video, we're going to talk about content management using what are called custom filters. So you can create custom filters for contacts. So let's go to contacts. And I want to talk about two different types of filters. So these filters here on the left are some of our default filters. So you can filter on tags. For example, if the tag is, isn't, is defined, is not defined. Let's say I want to filter on contacts who have the tag of Philly. And you can also filter on score. For example, I want to find all of the contacts who have a score value of greater than 20. So there are all my contacts that are being filtered. Uh, to remove a filter, you just hit the delete and hit that delete. You can close that filter. So these are some of our uh, dynamic filters. Uh, and you can clear here, which will clear all of the filters. But also you can create your own custom filters. So let's go to contacts and add edit filter. Here, let's go ahead and add a filter. Give the filter a name. I'm going to say Philly tagged with a with, uh, let's see, with, uh, let's see, score, if I can get this right, score of 20 or more. So I'm just naming it. So you add your condition. So keep in mind, you have two different types. You can set up one where it says it meets all of the following conditions, or you can set up this one where it will meet any of the following conditions. So what this add with all conditions mean is that in this example, the tag is, I'm going to say Philly, and the score, show you, can equal between or greater than. I'm going to say greater than 20. Okay. But you can also make the filter a little bit more robust by also looking for contacts or create a filter that will look for contacts that will meet all of these conditions and meet any of these conditions. So let's say I also want to look for any contacts that have the tag of Philly and a score greater than 20 and also have a tag of, let's see, I think I have a medical tag in here, in that might also meet a condition of last contacted date was, uh, let me see, on before, I'm going to say in the last 30 days. So I'm going to save this. So I'm going to go over this once more. This filter is saying filter for all contacts that have a tag of Philly, have a score that's greater than 20. And also, if they meet any of these conditions, they have a tag of medical and they was last contacted in the last 30 days. So I'm going to save it. So that's how you save the actual custom filter. To use the filter, go back to contacts and go here to filters and you'll see the list of filters and let's select that filter. There we are. And it tells you right here, that's the filter that's being used. And I'm showing three contacts that meet the filtering conditions that I created. So as you can see, filters are a great way to drill down or do custom searches for contacts. I hope this was helpful.